today I'm here with a new video and today we are talking about lipsticks. I'm going to show you my favorite lipsticks for 2020. I think last year I only had five. I have more than that this year. Uh, I do though have a lot of red lipsticks and this was so hard to pick. I was looking through my lipsticks and I was like whatever I used the most, whatever I used the least. I think this is like some f new formulas that I have tried during this year and that I found as new favorites. Some of them are older, some of them are new, some of them I have just had for a couple of months or maybe one month. But yeah, I will show you my favorite lipsticks and I actually have three 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 bullet lipsticks so i think we will start with them so two of them are two old ones from linda holberg cosmetics i love these to have when i don't have any other makeup or when i just have maybe done a base and i have really been loving pink opal this is a really really old one but i have actually been liking this so so much this year it is it just gives a little bit of a pink sheen to your lips and this is SPF 15. I love it. And the other one from Lena Holberg is Famous. This is maybe more like the grungier version of Pink Opal. Can I swatch like this? Do I still see what I'm doing? It looks like this. So as you see these are really really sheer. I love them both just to have them on, you don't have to worry about them so much. So these two I've been using a lot and I especially use this a lot on summer. And the third lipstick, I actually don't know if this is my favorite or not, but I have taken one from Lethal. Maybe this is more like a new formula that I'm liking. This is Rome. It is kind of neutral, neutral. I like their darker ones really, really much. But this one, I don't know. It's just something about this that I really like. As It's the same as the one from Linda Harburg. Just to slap them on. You don't have to care that much. I really like this. And I love that I bought all of these from Lethal. Because I actually don't have that many bullet lipsticks because liquid lipsticks is more my thing. But this one is really good. It was hard to decide on a color, but I think that one is my favorite. Maybe I should go into the two new formulas that I've tried this year that I have been loving. I think one of these are my absolute favorite lipstick. So the first one is actually a Velveteen from Lime Crime. I know, I was a little late to the game maybe. And this is Riot and this one is such an amazing color. I think they are kind of drying line crimes, but they are really good. It looks like this. So this is like a neutral, grungier vibe. I love this. I have used this in a lot of videos. And the other new one, I think you all knew, it's the Lunar Beauty Liquid Lipstick in Witch Bitch. This is one of my absolute favorite liquid lipsticks. The formula is amazing and the color, I love it. I love it so, so much. I have used this in a lot of videos and do you see this? Do you see this amazing red? It is always amazing, but do you see this? I I just love this. I am so happy that I bought it. I think this came out together with the Moonspell palette. I think they released this one and the black one, and this one is so good. I love this color so much, and I love the formula on it as well. Then a favorite that has come along from last year is, of course, Kaleidos. I love their lip tonics. These are like a lip stain 
and a liquid lipstick all in once and I last year I loved immersion I still love this one but then Kaleidos did something that I love them even more for they released two red ones I love these red ones one is okay I'm going I'm going to swatch them for you but I think Kaleidos has one of my absolute best formulas when it comes to a liquid lipstick so this is immersion as you see it's kind of sheer but it is so gorgeous on the lips I just love it it's something about this that makes me happy and I use it a lot and then collision I think <laughs> this is the shimmer one I can never remember yeah this is the shimmer one and I just or like the metallic but not the metallic I don't know but this is like one of the best reds I have and I have a lot it's just if you want to start to wear red I think these Kaleidos ones are a really good choice and the other red is Ambition and this is more matte and a little bit co cold toned and I can really recommend these if you're going to buy liquid lip tonics from Kaleidos I think you should go with Immersion and Ambition trust me I know what I'm talking about so these has been really super big favorites. I I just love Kaleidos lip tonic formula because it, it stains your lips so you can have it on for so long and now my hand is stained. And of course I can't have a lip favorite for the year without Nabla. I think Nabla is one of my... I think Nabla and Kaleidos is my favorite lip formulas with Nabla on the top. I think I love their liquid lipsticks. It's they are amazing. I have one on now that is Rogue Assassin. I think it is that one at least. Yeah. And they do red amazing reds. So maybe I should take one more because I actually have one more. That I really love from Nabla. So okay, we're going to talk about three from Nabla because I have loved all these three. First, we can start with the one that isn't the red. This is Kernel, and this I it wasn't that long time ago since I bought this one, and it has become one of my favorite shades. It's a darker, like pinkish lip lippy. I love this one. I know that this is like a bestseller on Nabla, or has been at least, and I totally understand why. And then rumors. The you just going to have to wait and see, and I think you will understand what I mean. This is rumors. This is amazing. Such an amazing red. And... They have really good formula Nabla and they do amazing liquid lipsticks. And the last favorite I have had this year from Nabla is Unspoken. I don't even want to know in how many videos I have had this. I bought this because I wanted a dupe for the Unicorn Blood from Jeffree Star because I don't want to use Jeffree Star on my channel. This is not dupe. This is darker than Unicorn Blood and I love it. I know that I got Angelica Lidemark to buy this. Yes, I succeeded. So this is unspoken and this is not for everyone. I know that, but do you see? To pair this with like a dark, dark green look, I, I love this. 
This Unspoken is one of my absolute favorite lipsticks in my collection and it's, it has been a super favorite with me. I can't remember when I bought it, but I don't know why I waited so long for it because you see how amazing this is. I love Nabla for doing these. So yeah, <laughs> that is my lipstick favorite for 2020. And I think this video went by pretty fast. I have been finding favorites that I think I will keep having for a long time. I can't like say my absolute favorite lipstick of this whole year. It might be unspoken because it's just an amazing shade, but I don't know. Or Immersion from Kaleidos. I have no idea, but all of these I have really, really loved. I'm actually feeling pretty like complete with my lipstick collection. I say that and I have two lipsticks on the way home to me. Two red ones. Oops. But yeah, I really hope you liked this video and please tell me which has been your favorite lipstick for this year. I know it's a hard question for some, like for me, because I love lipsticks. But yeah, I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do because I'm trying to upload each and every day now in December and I hope that I will see you tomorrow. Bye!